Well, it took me a year, but I finally completed a slideshow from our global adventure, spanning epic destinations from northern Arizona all the way to southern Utah. I sifted through 200 breathtaking photos that Dale and I had taken and threw in a few that I took with Jake and Joanna at the same places. Let's get going. Dale is hoping to add a California condor to his digital trophy case of cool birds. We got lucky and saw at least 13 of them hanging out under the bridge and flying around the nearby cliffs. According to Wikipedia, here are some fun facts. Condors are one of the rarest birds in the world. They have a 10-foot wingspan and are the largest flying birds in North America, and it was declared extinct in the wild in 1987. 20 of the living birds were then collected for conservation, resulting in 504 of them living today.
Took 89A, saw the condors. Went down all the way down to here. And then we took these roads all the way. Oops. All the way up to White Pocket. White Pocket, okay, cool. So we're gonna have to go back down <laughs> like this and then back up again to 89. control is going to crawl us out of this deep sand oh my god my foot's on the my foot's on the floor the van is just barely moving us it's just crawling us out of the sand and here we go caught up
take a break before I do this. I'm gonna try this. I'm gonna take this line. Doesn't look too bad. Yeehaw! Ugh. Can climb. He didn't even fall.
On today's journey, we explored a network of Forest Service roads through an actual forest in Arizona. If you take the right turns, you end up at a place officially called End of the World. You can Google it, End of the World Flagstaff, to learn more. Now this gal stopped the herd when she saw us. She stared at us for at least five minutes and at one point turned toward us and took a couple of steps. It looked kind of aggressive and was a little creepy. It was hilarious watching the rest of the herd getting restless. They were like children standing in line at the post office. <laughs>